hello there welcome back to another video in today's video we are going to make this simple recipe so stay tuned so first we need one cup of wheat flour one tablespoon of salt and then we mix the ingredients together so at this point we're going to need a larger sieve we also need 150 grams of boiled potatoes and then we will pulverize them through the sieve or you can just mash the potatoes but this one here will help us to get finer particles of the potatoes and get rid of the bigger lumps so we are done mashing now we're going to remove the potatoes from the sieve so you can see they are very finely mashed and then we mix with the dough mix and make a dough So we also need 100 grams of cornstarch. Cornstarch will help the potatoes to be crispy. So at this point you can mix with your hand to make sure that all the ingredients are well incorporated. So if the dough is hard as this you can add 100 ml of water and then make a dough so we're going to make the dough the dough should be hard and not soft so we are done now we're going to transfer it into a larger working area Spread some flour on your working area so that the dough doesn't stick to the surface. And then we're going to roll out the dough. So roll out the dough to the maximum. So once it is well rolled, now at this point we are going to need a cookie cutter. So we didn't have one, we improvised. So we're going to use this to cut our dough. So cut the dough as shown in the video. So we are done cutting the dough this is how good it looks so now let's get let's remove the excess dough meanwhile preheat your cooking oil in a pan So this is how they are looking like. Now we are going to deep fry them. So for them to bubble up, you have to pour oil on on the top. As you can see here. 
they are bubbling up nice bubble so guys if you like this kind of videos kindly subscribe to the channel and give this video a very big thumbs up don't forget to share and leave a comment so as you can see they are bubbling up so let them cook for two to three minutes on low medium heat they are ready now nicely cooked so here we have our bubble chips So let's demonstrate one more time. Pour in pour the oil on top so that they can bubble up. Don't turn fast. Once they have bubble up and then turn. So they're ready. Kindly support the channel by liking and subscribing to the channel so that you can be notified every time we upload a new video. So here are our bubble chips. Looking all yummy. So thank you so much guys for watching the video to the end. That's all we had for today see you in my next video bye bye